Hi guys, my name is Ferdy and in this video series I will talk about the amazing features of the Astra theme. One of the best themes for WordPress. There's a free version that has a lot of capabilities, but there are also premium upgrades and in this video series I will cover every topic. If you want to get one of the premium packages of the Astra theme, you can go to ferdycorp.com forward slash Astra. This is an affiliate link, so when you buy this through my link I get a commission, so thank you for that. Then you can choose a package and click on get started. You can pay with credit card or PayPal. Then you can download all the premium plugins, upload them to your website, activate them, and then through these tutorials, I will show you step by step how all the premium plugins work. If you like what you're seeing so far, please like this video. And if you want to see more upcoming videos, please consider to subscribe and click on the bell notification so you'll get an update when I upload a new video. Now let's get started. In this video, I will talk about white label branding. What does it mean? So there's a really big company. They have a lot of bottles of wine. They sell that to smaller companies and those smaller companies sell wine to their customers. What you can do with white labeling is actually that you remove the label of the big company and then you put your own label on that wine bottle. So I buy wine from a very big company. I put my own label on it and I say, this is Ferdy Corp wine. And that is the wine I will sell to people and people that drink that wine, they think, wow, that is Ferdy Corp wine. It is delicious. In this case, I make websites for clients. And when my clients go to their WordPress website, they see I made it with the Astra theme. And using white label branding, I can change all the names of Astra into the names I want to change. Let me show you how it works. I go to the back end. I go to appearance, themes, and here I see Astra, the Astra theme. This is the version by Brainforce. You can even click on it. Then you go to the website of Brainforce and maybe I want to hide that. I can do that. If I go to plugins, I can use starter site. I'll talk about it in another tutorial. But what you can do with that is that you can import a complete website with a few clicks. Maybe you don't want to show that to your client that you have done that. So then you can rename Astra Pro over here. And you can also rename all the other plugins that are Astra related. How can we do that? I go to appearance, Astra options. I scroll down all the way and here you see white label. I click on settings and now we can rewrite some stuff. So the agency author is Ferdy Corpers Hook. That's my full name. And I can say HTTPS, my website, ferdycorpershook.com. Here's the agency license link. I work with a license and the great thing about Astra is when you get a package, doesn't matter which one, as long as you get the pro package, you can use it on unlimited websites. So you can get Astra and use it on 20 different websites for clients. And then you get a license code. You can place a license code. And if that doesn't work, then they need to go to this link. So they don't go to Astra. Hey, my website doesn't work, but they go to you because you are the one that has the access to all the licenses. So that's the license link. And then we have the theme branding. What's the theme name? Well, my theme name is Ferdy Corp theme. And the description is the best theme for your website. I can have a screenshot URL in order to get it. I go to media and you can upload it. And it's important. I've done it already, by the way. It's important that it is 1200 pixels by 900. So I grab the URL over here. I copy it. I close this and I paste it over here. Then I scroll down the Astra Pro branding. Well, that's if we use Astra Pro and I don't want to call this Astra Pro. I want to call this Ferdy Corp Pro plugins or Pro modules. Make your website even better with Ferdy Corp Pro modules. And if I have different Astra related plugins, you'll see them over here and I can rename them. I save the changes. And now if I go to themes, you see the Ferdy Corp theme, this version by Ferdy Corp. So if I click over here, I go to my website. If I go to Ferdy Corp theme over here, and this is not active, I can get in contact through ferdycorpsuk.com forward slash contact. So that's great. And if I want to take it a step further over here, you see white label. Maybe I want to hide this even for the client. Then I can go to the settings and I click on enable white label. I save the changes. And now 
you don't see that option. So it looks like this. I think that looks better because now you don't see all this stuff over here. So nothing is related with Astra. Also here you see Freddy Corp theme. If I want to bring this back, if I want to take a look at the settings, I can go to plugins. And also over here you see Freddy Corp modules. I need to deactivate it. Now I can activate it. And now at appearance, Freddy Corp theme, it is here again. So I can click on settings and I can change things. So that's what you can use using white label branding. I want to thank you for watching this video. I hope you learned a ton of stuff. Feel free to like this video and to subscribe for more upcoming videos. And I hope you have a great day and you will see me next time. Bye bye.